uh, tuturi mooks from scratch. Actually, guys, gumawa na ako ng mga videos before ng tuturi mook or acorn jelly. Actually, hindi ako tinuruan nito kasi hindi naman lahat alam ng aking mother-in-law. Ako, ni-research ko ito kung paano gawin. Kasi ako, I like cooking, I like making things, I like doing DIY. So, you have to research as well and use your common sense. May chances na kasi na hindi naman tinuturo lahat ni ng mother-in-law mo. Or hindi nila alam kung paano gawin. Or sometimes, ayaw lang nilang gawin. Kasi minsan, tinatamad, medyo may edad na rin kasi si nanay. This is how I make it. At first try, medyo siya malagsak or jelling jelly siya. Yung second try, medyo may problema. Nung third try ko na perfect ko. So, this one is my fourth try. So, I hope you like these videos and give it a try. Actually, this is good for dieting. Some people may not appreciate what I'm doing, but I just want to share it to you. Na matutunan kayo in the end. In some other places, in some other countries, they are not eating acorn nuts. So, this one gives you an idea of how to eat acorn nuts. Okay, so I hope you like it. So, guys, last week, I showed you a video of Sarah and me harvesting chestnut and acorn nuts on the wild. In case you didn't see it, I will put it on the description box below so that you know how we pick up acorn nuts and chestnut. So here is the example that we find and collect acorn nuts to make it tuturi mook. In case you didn't know yet, tuturi or acorn nuts came from oak tree and it looks like this. Tapos, ito sa fragrance natin yung kinuha. Yan, kasama ko siyang nagpulot sa fragrance. Some tuturi or acorn nuts we found on the playground and some on the forest. Most of the Koreans, they love to eat tuturi mukmuchim or acorn nuts jelly mixed with vegetable and spices. And then after collecting it, we're going to wash it properly because it came from the ground. We eat need to be washed. This is how I make and open the, the acorn nuts and you will see the inside bean it of it. Some people, they soak it first in the water for 2 to 3 days and then afterward, dry it under the sun and you can easily take off the shell. Actually guys, Tutirimuk does not spoil easily so it used as a lunch bag during traveling. Do you know guys that acornet is actually the replacement of coffee beans before? That is during the time that people don't have any idea and information about propagation of coffee. So they use this one in exchange. After taking off the shell, I need to blend it like this. Put some water. And then we're going to drain it. So ayan guys, sasalain po natin siya at tatanggalin po natin yung pinakasabaw niya. So this will be the base of the starch to make a corn jelly. The taste of this homemade jelly is different from the commercial items. So we're going to drain it and strain it. And on the other bowl, we're going to take off and drain for the second time and third time as well and then we're going to put it on this container to store for almost two or three days guys we soak it for almost two or three days para matanggal yung dagpa your tannins niya because it is very toxic when you eat it and also i take off the water two or three times and then i refill it like that so that it will take off the toxicities of the acorn. So after two or three days of soaking, acorn nuts starts from the water. And then we're going to start now to cook it. We're going to heat it the pans and then we're going to mix. We're going to use low heat and be patient to cook the starts some people prefer not to make like this from the scratch because you can buy also some of this acorn nuts flour in the market 
but it has different taste. Iba yung sunmat na sinasabi o yung ikaw yung talagang gumagawa kasi iba yung lasa. Traditional Koreans used to like or love this kind of food that you prepare from the scratch and using your hands guys and it's really organic and koreans love the original taste of the food the natural taste as is walang flavoring so after a few minutes of mixing patiently you will achieve this starchy and jelly texture and then we're going to transfer it in the two balls After putting it in the bowl, we're going to make it cold in the refrigerator. Guys, ganito na po yung ating ikon jelly. It looks like this. And when going to slice it and getting ready to make it for our side dish. Very delicious. Jelly jelly ang dating niya guys. Mmm, sarap. Ito yung tuturimok na nagawa natin. So, ang gagawin natin ngayon ay gagawa tayo ng sauce. Ilalagay natin dito. So, what you're going to prepare for the sauce, we need the soy sauce, maple syrup, or sugar, si sugar if you like, and then the ground garlic, leaves of onions. I cut it using the scissor to make it fast, and then sesame seed oil, sesame seed, and then going to mix it. If you want to make it spices or spicier, you can put chili powder. This is the simple acorn nuts jelly for side. Some people, they put it cucumber and also lettuce. So we're going to taste the acorn nuts jelly together with the spices that we made. My daughter loves this kind of food. She likes acorn jelly. And by the way, guys, most of the monks love this. And they usually prepare it during their festival or for their ordinary meals. Monks are vegetarian and after you eat tutori mook, it has actually meat taste. So guys, what can you say about my videos? I hope you like it, learn some ideas and infos about it. Please leave a comment, like, and consider subscribing. And yohiga sayo, God bless everyone.